Hi, Beauty Experts Advent Calendar is coming on October 15th. It costs £100 and it ships worldwide. It is a 12-day Advent Calendar. Everything inside is full-sized. There are only 12 products. So you can either open uh, each drawer uh, on every other day during Advent or in the last 12 days of Advent or you can open uh, each drawer right after Christmas during the 12 days of Christmas up to Epiphany. But you know, I'd rather open everything the moment I get it. So this is Beauty Expert's third advent calendar. Hang on, I'll just show you the first one. So that is the first one, 2017. And I have the unboxing, which I will link up in the description box below. It opens like this. Hang on. And there are 12 drawers. Uh, I'll show you how I repurpose these uh, very soon, maybe in about January or so. It's great fun to repurpose the servant calendar. Right, so let me just put this away. So the packaging this year looks very similar. White box, 12 days, with some gold in it, as you can see here. So the price tag is £100, as I said, but the contents are worth more than £480. Let's see if all that is true. Off we go. The first product inside this advent calendar is the Avant Skincare Scumptuous Glycolic Acid Hand Balm. I've never come across a hand balm containing glycolic acid before. That sounds very nice, very luscious, very uh, exfoliating and renewing for the skin on your hands. And uh, that is where, you know, signs of aging start showing very early. And this costs for 50 mils. 92 pounds. I've never used a hand cream that costs 92 pounds. 50 ml full size. Uh, it also contains uh, capric, caprylic, shea butter and sorbitol in addition to the glycolic acid. So revitalize aging hands with the Armand Skin Care Sumptuous Glycolic Hand Balm. The formula penetrates deep into the skin's layer to restructure the surface for youthful looking skin. Glycolic acid firms and smooths the complexion. Complexion? It's the hands reducing the appearance of fine lines and wrinkles and treating oiliness. This is a hand cream. Shea butter brightens dull skin and leaves it softly, touchably soft and supple. So this is clearly the big ticket item in this year's Beauty Expert Advent Calendar. In 2017, the big ticket item was actually the Cult 51 cream. There was a very generous 50 ml jar inside the 2017 Advent Calendar and that cost 100 pounds full size. So one product right there, entire cost of the advent calendar. That was in 2017. In, the, in this advent calendar, in the 2019 one, this one hand cream is 92 pounds and you pay 100 quid for the entire advent calendar. Next product, Madara Eye Contour Cream, 26 pounds. That is also full-sized at 15 mils. So I've actually tried the Madara Smart Antioxidants Anti-Fatigue Eye Rescue Cream and it was very, very nice, very hydrating for the under eye area from Adara. And uh, this contains northern parsley and fresh cucumber, and it is supposed to reduce puffiness and dark circles. That sounds very nice. I'm an eye cream junkie, uh, although I do confess that there are certain nights when I forget to wear eye cream. So this sounds nice as well. The next product is something that we, I have used before. It is the e-cooking peel mask, and uh, the full size is 50 mils, and it costs 37 so this is actually an acid-based mask. I got a sample from a Cult Beauty goodie bag back in the day and then I bought the full size from Cult Beauty because it was that good. It, it contains lactic acid, glycolic acid, uh, salicylic acid, hyaluronic acid and so on, gluconolactone and citric acid. So you're supposed to apply it for about five or six minutes first and then you know work up to 12 minutes eventually and then you know rinse off the lot there will be some prickling and redness as the acid does its work and then you're left with glowing exfoliated skin i love this mask next thing christoph robin moisturizing hair cream and this is also full sized at 100 mils and costs 33 pounds so this it, it contains spf 6 <laughs> Uh, and it's a daily leave-in treatment for split ends. It pre prevents split ends and breakage. And it is suitable for all hair types. It contains sandalwood lotion, apricot kernel oil, philodendron tree bark and barley to penetrate deeply into your hair and hydrate it without weighing it down or changing your hair color. It is a non-sticky formula. I have used a, a, a couple of other Christoph Robin products before and my favorite happens to be a hair mask containing prickly pear oil. I haven't tried this. Next, we have Esper's Energizing Shower Gel, 250 mils full-sized 
retailing at £22. An instantly enlivening shower gel to gently cleanse the skin while the zesty aroma helps awaken the senses. Coconut extract creates a naturally firming lather to deep cleanse, while eucalyptus revitalizes and peppermint energizes the body and the mind. This is incidentally sulfate free. Next product, Eve Long. No, 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 it is not the balm as such. It is the gel balm cleanser. Full size, 100 mils, retails at 45 pounds. Uh, incidentally, this is what the cleansing balm looks like. And the packaging, as you can see, of the gel balm cleanser is different. So this is uh, something that trans it's actually a gel that transforms into a milky balm when applied to the skin. And, uh, you know, it sort of emulsifies into a milky balm. It contains shea butter, unfortunately, which breaks me out, and grapeseed oil. Um, I am i don't love Eve, Eve Lorme. I used to when it first came out. And, you know, uh, someone recently said that, you know, Emma Hardy and uh, other cleansing balms that came after Eve Lorme improved upon the formula, less greasy residue, more emulsification, easier to take off. And I feel that is true, you know, the original Eve Long cleansing balm, when I first used it, I loved it. But then, you know, I started using Emma Hardy and other cleansing balms. The formula was definitely less greasy, less residue, less sticky, less strong, less gritty, less smelly. <laughs> and, uh, you know, I preferred this formula. The next thing is Philogas Meso Mask, which I have received a sample of in a Look Fantastic Beauty box. I didn't love it. It didn't wow me. There was nothing very special about this mask. The thing is... You get 30 mils in the Zadrat calendar and full size is 50 mils, which retails at 44. Beauty expert has said that the 30 mil uh, mask costs 33 pounds, but you know, retail is 50 mils at 44 pounds. So this is a very creamy, moisturizing and hydrating mask. Unfortunately, contains mineral oil, which is very, very bad for my skin. Breaks me out very badly was responsible for acne that I got here a couple of weeks ago. You either get that, the meso mask, or you get the Philoga Sleep and Peel. You get 30 mils of that, which retails supposedly at £34.20. However, full size is 50 mils, which retails at £57. Now, this one is actually a resurfacing night cream. It is a tissue renewal booster that suits the skin. Uh, it contains six hydroxy acids, AHA and BHA, and has a perfectly safe peeling effect and action on wrinkles. Now, of the two, I would prefer this because it contains AHA and BHA. The next product from a brand that I don't actually love because it contains too many essential oils for my liking, it is from Balance Me. It is their Hyaluronic Plumping Primer. You get 30 mils and that retails at £26. That is indeed full-sized. So this one is infused with acacia gum complex to plump the skin and contains hyaluronic acid as well to create a protective and hydrating shield and to improve skin moisturization and elasticity. So this contains essential oils of neroli, rose, citrus, chamomile, geranium, blackberry, yarrow, shea butter, so many things that irritate my skin. Personally not a fan of Balance Me products because of the plethora of uh, essential oils that they add. Next product from a brand I love, Morley Sleep Dharma P Pillow Mist. 50 mils is full sized and that retails for 22 pounds. Calm the body, spirit and soul with the Morley Rituals Pillow Mist, a soothing pillow mist that helps relieve the stresses of the day and inspire restful, restorative slumbers. I don't mind pillow mist, but you know, there is a danger of them being too strong and you know strong fragrances actually give me a migraine rather than putting me to sleep so i really hope this one is mild for those of you who are migrainey and plan on getting the advent calendar uh or you know migraine prone and those of you who don't love very strong scents uh at least it is not that this works pillow spray the deep sleep one which we've seen an overkill of we've seen too many of in uh, advent calendars, gifts with grudges and beauty boxes recently. That one, you know, it, I liked it at first and then, you know, I was so annoyed with receiving so many that I hate the smell now. Can't stand the deep sleep pillow spray from this works. Next product, Elemis Pro Collagen Overnight Matrix, 30 mils, 87 pounds is the retail price. Uh, 50 mils is the actual full size and that retails for 145 pounds. So what is it? It is an anti-aging night cream that works to promote a smoother and more refined appearance and is fortified with a unique Mediterranean algae, Padina pavonica, 
and revolutionary smart drone technology. What is drone technology doing in a night cream? So that apparently acts as a targeted delivery system and it is a lightweight formula that delivers farming benefits for skin that bounces back to life. So it contains sunflower oil, lavender oil, camphor oil, orange oil, grape oil, clove oil. Those are the ingredients that I can recognize. It also contains sodium hyaluronate or hyaluronic acid. It also contains vegetable oil. Lots of oils in there. Entirely up to you if you're breakout prone. I wouldn't love this. Next product, we actually have makeup in here. Ila Masca OMG highlighter. And that retails at £34. And I think it's very pretty. Uh, I did receive uh, an Ila Masca highlighter in last year's Look Fantastic Advent Calendar uh, in the shade Deity. And I, I love the La Masca makeup. In my opinion, they don't get as much love as they ought to. Next product, we have the Inica Bold Lash Mascara, 12 mils full size, retails at £27. Um, that, well, it is apparently an ultimate vegan formula to add volume to lashes and create a daring look, voluminizing for intense, thick lashes, dramatically intensified look in a single swipe, volume creating brush, non clumpy. Certified vegan, cruelty free. So two makeup products in this advent calendar. Rather surprising, beauty expert is normally, you know, skincare, bath and body and spa centric rather than makeup centric. So two makeup products is actually surprising for this advent calendar. Overall though, the contents, how do I feel? I feel that the, the advent calendar from 2017 was their best with that Cult 51 cream, followed by last year's. I'll just very quickly tell you what the two contained. So the 2017 one contained Paula's Choice BHA full size Omrovitsa Queen of Hungary in the standard. This was before it was, you know, we were inundated with it and it became everywhere. The Cult 51 cream, the Chorus Charger, Kudali Hand and Nail Cream, 75 mils, beautiful product there. Philoga Lip Balm, uh, I repurchased this. It remains my favorite lip balm till date. Balance Me Primer, which I didn't love. Gatino Floracil Eye Makeup Remover, which I liked. Evelon lip color not the cleansing bar a lip color which i liked the skimono beauty mask um algenist eye renewal bar full size pie rosehip oil my absolute favorite facial oil so this was a very nice advent calendar for me and at the time uh omarovica wasn't everywhere yet so i enjoyed this now 2018's advent calendar contained the evelon cleanser yes that one not the lip balm that cleansing balm Elemis Peptide Night Recovery Cream Oil, Espor Optimal Skin Pro Serum, Ilamasca Hydra Veil Primer, Nook Slip Balm, a product I love particularly for dry weather, Molten Brown Pink Pepper Powder, Char Gel, my absolute favorite fragrance, Balance Me Radiance Facial Oil, Aromatherapy Associates De Stress Muscle Gel, Lipstick Queen Lipstick, Madara uh, Anti Fatigue Rescue Eye Cream, and Doctor's Formula. Marine Collagen Anti-Aging Day Moisturizer. So you can see that certain brands have been repeated over the years. Evlon, Elemis, Balance Me, Ila Masca, which is actually owned by the Hutt Group who own Beauty Experts. So no surprises there. So these brands have been repeated, first of all. Secondly, I find that there are four or five products that I'm very excited about. The hand cream, the eye cream, the e-cooking mask, which I've used and loved before, the Ila Masca highlighter, uh, and maybe, maybe uh, the Filoga Sleep and Peel. So four or five products that I'm very excited about. The rest, they either contain mineral oil or shea butter or too many essential oils. They don't work for me. I've tried them before. There's some problem or the other with the other products. So I'm not too excited about this curation, to be very, very, very honest. If you're new to these brands, these products, if you're new to skincare, you will love this. Great savings to be had here. Very, very, very good value for the money. So if you're getting the Meso mask, the Sardvent calendar is in its entirety, calculating all those uh, prices, is worth £484. If you're getting the Sleep and Peel instead, it is worth £485.20. Massive savings to be had, great bargain, because you're only paying £100 for the Advent calendar. So no complaining there at all. It is just that, personally, for me, I don't find more than four or five products in here exciting, but that is subjective, just an opinion. You love it, go for it by all means. So it all depends on how new to this you are, uh, how much you will be using each of the products in here. If you can use more, you know, this is a very good bargain. As I said, £380 
of savings to be had in the Zadvat calendar. The only thing is I do wish the Kirishan had been a bit different. I do wish they'd left out Evelon, Elemis and Esper, which we, we're seeing year after year after year. Maybe other brands would have been nice, you know, just a change. That's all I'm saying. So those are my thoughts on this year's Beauty Expo 12 Days of Christmas uh, collection, the, the 12 Day Advent Calendar. Honest thoughts, personal opinion, do tell me yours in the comments below. I would love to know. So that's all from me for today. Thank you for watching this video. Please do give me a thumbs up. Please do hit the subscribe button and please do ring the notifications bell and I will speak to you soon.